Hi, hello. <laughs> this is JD speaking. Here we go. Um, hi, this is certainly something new. I was uh, keen to bring in, uh, you know, something new to, to the stream other than Hades. So this is what I went for. Okay, so no joke today, as I opened the, the Steam app, you know, I was preparing myself to stream, and then I saw it, it hit me right in the face, it was the first thing that I, that it showed me. Um, Dragon Ball Z Kakarot on sale, 60% off. And I was, I was like, okay, if, if this isn't a sign, I don't know what it is, okay? <laughs> because I was also, like, I was going to check the store in case anything there was interesting and worth picking up. And... Uh, I saw a sale for Far Cry, which I also picked up, but then, um, and that's right now installing and downloading, but Kakarot was the one thing that stood out, and I was like, you know, like, this is the thing that makes sense, because here I even say it in my bio, I am like, you know, a huge Dragon Ball fan, and I've been ever since I'm a kid, like, one of the kind, like, one of the cutest memories that I have uh, with my father is watching Dragon Ball Z. Uh, and Dragon Ball, the original series, and also Dragon Ball GT, uh, every day, religiously, uh, at 6 p.m. And I remember the exact time, and it was truly a fantastic thing to do, because my father loves it too, so here we were, uh, you know, just two fans having a lot of fun watching uh, the series. And I grew up watching it, and uh, he grew up watching it as well. Well, not growing up. But maybe like, you know, as a teen and so on. So I'm like, you know, I, I've heard very good things about the game. And uh, it only makes sense. You know, I'm like, yeah, I was going to pick it up anyway. And I know that one of the thing that the other games that I want to pick up and play is uh, Fighter C. Although I'm, I'm going to get destroyed there. But at least just enjoying the story and, and the fighting. But, you know, little by little. Tonight, I just really want to like get into this and i bought the the deluxe version and uh, you know when i when i installed it it appeared like a lot of signs that i didn't want to read about oh you don't like this and you don't like that and i'm like okay I'll, I'll figure it out as soon as i enter the game but i just really want to like hit new game and, and start playing without all those interruptions and i didn't want to put you guys through all those different alerts and things you know because that's boring uh in my opinion and I'm just gonna check out uh, that my microphone is working correctly because otherwise I'm a fool and I've been speaking uh, to myself this whole time. And uh, yeah, it seems like we're ready to go. So I'm gonna... Okay, come back, please. There you go. Okay, there it goes. So I'm gonna... I don't know what this is. It showed me like it's a card game or something. I'm like, okay, that's cool, but I, I want to hit new game right away. So that's what we're gonna do. I've heard many, many, many uh, good things about it, about the game. Uh, and I think this is one of the games that um, it's like very heavy to play, uh, as in the files and everything. So yeah, here we go. And I do know the story, but yeah, I'm going to shut up now. God, I love the music. And Piccolo was so cool back then. I like to do a little image training every now and then to make sure I don't get too rusty. Time to see what I can do. And you're just the guy to help me do that. Right, I'm guessing this is like, yeah, I'm guessing this is the, the tutorial. I'm just so hyped. It, this reminds me so much of like watching the series, but also playing the games back then in the PS2. Okay, so Ward, uh, Burst, okay. Okay, that's my, okay, that's weird, but okay. 
this is weird. This is not the, the thing that I'm used to in, in Dragon Ball games. Support power it, and then transformation power it, both. And then super attack is this. Okay, I'll try to remember that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, this is the ward. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, scissors, paper, rock. Okay, and this is the step. I'm, I'm so used to hitting people with X. That is just weird to be hitting B instead, especially because of Xenobers. Okay, I can charge my key. Okay, that's good to know. Okay, okay, this is a bad idea. Okay, awful. Body blow, what the hell? Okay. This seems like it's gonna be tough, honestly, to learn. I'm not used to that. And uh, usually, Dragon Ball C games are super easy and simple. Okay, tension gauge will fill when both your tension gauge and your key are full. Hold Y to activate the search effect. What the hell? Okay, this is bad. Just. Okay, I didn't do anything with mine. Come on. Yeah, yeah, I know that I can ward. <clears throat> okay, I'm not doing what the game is telling me, so okay. Let's just ward. And then, okay, I do want to know, okay, I don't have supports. Stop hitting Y. I just think I'm going to do a, a really strong hit with Y, just like in Xenoverse, but that's not the case. I still got an S rank, which I'm guessing it means nothing. Because, you know, it's just a tutorial, but yeah. And at this point, they hated each other, by the way. Yeah, I remember. And by this point, actually, Piku was the strongest on Earth. Because Goku had stopped training because of, of Gohan. Yeah, all right. I don't need this story recap, I know it. I think everybody who plays this game probably knows everything that there is to know about Dragon Ball, really. I mean, it's, uh, at least I would think so. And there's Raditz, yeah. Long-haired man, okay. <laughs> Brony man, okay. <laughs> right, it's the rant. Intimidating man, okay. That's us, guys. He mentioned us. Okay, I'm just kidding. 
It's just like when people just fanboy out because they mentioned their countries. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Though this has really confused me a lot because uh, the the story goes that you know Kakarot was sent uh, to conquer Earth, but then later it seems like it wasn't the case, and he wasn't sent in a mission. He was sent just to be protected uh, from Frieza. He was so cool. He's the strongest guy I've ever fought in my whole life. I don't think anybody's gotten me more pumped up than him. I want to fight him again. So I'm hoping to get stronger and soon. I'd be afraid to fight someone like that. <laughs> you know, I bet you'd be just fine if you trained yourself up a bit. I don't think mom would like that very much. She wouldn't. Chi-Chi asked us to get some ingredients for her. How could I not remember that? All right, here we go, I guess. Uh, think. What else did she need again? Oh, uh, I think she wanted some fish and apples, Dad. Oh, yeah, right. Let's just see if we can't find us some apples around this place. Okay, I'll go. Gohan sure is full of energy. Yeah, okay, no right. Let's see. I, I know that this has a lot of missions and now, okay. A key blast? I don't know why I need a key blast to, to explore the world, but okay. Boost flight, examine and talk, jump. Okay, it seems fairly easy. To be honest. Okay, the main menu and then hold. Okay, vertical ascension. This, this seems fairly easy. Slice of life. Okay, let's see. Okay, this seems... Ah, oh, okay. Where was he? This seems really nice. This game looks really good, in my opinion at least. Let's try to find one more. What do you say? <laughs> Leave it to me. Oh, I can't lie yet. I can jump, but I can't fly it. Hey now. Don't go wandering too far. What am I picking up? Oh, okay, river shrimp. I guess I should keep an eye on Gohan. But he's moving too slow. Okay, where the hell? Ooh. Okay, that was cool. Okay, there he goes. Where did that son of mine? Oh yeah, we got plenty of apples now. Thanks for finding me, Gohan. I get it. And I don't blame you. Hang in there, I got an idea. We'll catch some fish and then head straight home. Okay. Okay, there you go. I remember watching like the filler episode. I don't know if it's canon of uh, Goku. You got it. Try to keep up though. I have to keep you close, god damn it. Um I remember watching the filler episode of, of Goku not like literally not giving a shit about naming Gohan and just straight up like going fishing 
instead. And Chi Chi and Ox, the Ox King was really mad at them, uh, at him, because he was like, you know, I'll figure out the name eventually, right? Yeah, god damn it. I guess I can carry you if you want. Oh, that's cute. Okay. Seems like Okay, this This game's make this game makes like an effort to make Goku look like, you know, a good father and a good person, which the series sometimes doesn't try. Because, like, well, even the creator of, of Dragon Ball has said that he's a terrible father. <laughs> but then also the fact that... <laughs> yeah. Ah, oh, come on, go on, man. Too bad. This is kind of cute, yeah. Okay, let's move. Like we have to move. I want to play more. Okay. Alright, at last. Okay, that's weird. That like that's a really weird side. That's so weird to see like adult Goku. Okay, it was good. It wasn't perfect. Okay. With a with a freaking tail, dude. It's so long too. Alright. All right, so yeah, like, god damn it, okay, eat a meal, yeah, casually the fire is there ready, uh, I don't know which one to make, really. Uh, okay. And it has effect. Okay, so plus 1% to key defense. Okay, and this is... Uh, no, I have another one, right? Or am I tripping? This one. I mean, it's the same one. Okay. <laughs> okay, yeah, thank you very much. Man, I'm stuffed. Is there anything better than some fresh fish in your belly? Ugh, think I eat too much though. <laughs> well, if you want to be as big as your dad, you're going to have to eat a lot of this stuff. <laughs> right. This is wholesome as hell. Oh, come on, man. I had fun today too. Thanks for your help. I'll teach you how to fish next time so we can do it together. Okay. I can't wait. Okay. 
Soul emblems. I don't know what that is, but okay. Okay, as you're gonna explain to me. Are items that represent a relationship with certain characters and can be obtained as you progress through the story. Uh, okay, they can be viewed in the community item. Like the community menu. Don't do anything by themselves, but setting them to a community board, you can activate effects that will help you on your adventure. Okay. Okay, that's cute. A community rank. What the hell? In this community, you can activate community skill that will help you in the battle. Okay. With an empty panel, select it. Press A to display the... Okay. So... Selecting Gohan. Next to Goku. There he goes. Okay, Ultimate Father's Son Team, alright. Oh yeah, Dad! I meant to tell you. I found this while you were fishing. Really? Sacred text of martial arts. I don't know if I want to use it though. What what the hell? I guess I have to. Okay, there he goes. Now talk to Gohan. Okay, I'm gonna check out the area a little bit more because I also like kind of uh, move a little bit. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. I'm gonna be moving, but I just, I kind of just wanna, like, move around. As and finish the point that I was saying that I watched that and, um, like he basically like, obviously because he wasn't uh, raised as as normal people, but he just didn't really care about naming. Oh, come on. But can I not? Ah. Okay, so like he didn't care about naming Gohan, but it was like almost as a, almost as a fluke that he named him Gohan, and I thought that he had been before, you know, like a really cute thing, like a way to throw back to his to his grandpa, but it wasn't really that way. It just happened casually. I'm just gonna fish one more time because I can and I want to do it. I think it's fun, and if I do it perfectly. Oh, go to grade, at least. Maybe I get better results. <laughs> oh, get a load of that. Eh, I mean, it's almost the same, but whatever. Okay, now I'll, I'll go talk to Gohan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nope, it wasn't much of a point. I was just reminiscing and watching that, I guess. <laughs> Not really a dinosaur, is it, though? I'd say that's a dragon. But I don't know, I, I guess. I mean, if he says so, he's the one who knows his own world. Ah, okay. For acquiring super attacks, so make sure you collect as many as you can, okay? Okay, that's... Like, this is weird, honestly. How do I? Okay, that's how. Okay, so what if I want to collect them all, but I also don't want to have to go to like 
the whole mess of moving with divine nimbus because Jesus Christ is as wonky as fuck. Or maybe I just don't know how to freaking handle it, to be honest. That would be fair as well. But they do seem important. Okay. It's moving along. Oh. And where is the house, by the way? I completely forgot. Like, I know I have it in my map. Where the hell is it? Okay, there it is. And how do I... Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. There it goes. <laughs> She's so mad, bro. Oh, God. Okay. Oh god, there's even a mini game to to do lunch. If you yeah, you like add you actually cook in this game, okay. If you have fruit, meat, fish, or other ingredients, you can get them cooked by Chi Chi, okay. Or by other cooks, right. Um provides a special effects such as boost to stats and temporary support effects. Uh, they are called meal effects. Okay, all right. I guess the recipes as well. That that like that's cool. Uh, I mean, make a dish, I guess, and select boil fish. Okay, they're telling me what the hell. Yeah. Okay, that's interesting. I had no idea I was getting into such a like an in-depth type of experience. I guess it just like it's just so weird. In, in like in my eyes that they made even like a cooking and a fishing. Oh my god. Hell yeah This is so cool. Oh Man, I love the Dra OG Dragon Ball. It's so freaking cool Yeah, 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 I know Oh, it's it's even telling me a story. I apologize. I didn't even read it. I mean I <laughs> Yeah yeah, because Aquilin uh, drew in this in the stone that Master Roshi drew, or the rogue that that, Ma that Master Roshi drew. Uh, oh God, like this is so cool. Okay, I was gonna talk about Chi Chi, but. <laughs> there you go. Oh, and did I get an emblem? That will help you cook, okay. Uh, wait a freaking minute. Oh no, but I have, like, if I have her, if I have my, my emblems there, in the in the effects one then I don't want them in the cooking one for now yeah the the hat and the four star dragon ball yeah After you killed him, but okay. Oh yeah. <laughs> it's so awesome to watch this man. Yeah, 
Oh boy. Ah, that ain't gonna happen, Chi Chi. I apologize. I was gonna talk about Chi Chi just in general. How, yeah, okay, how um, she was such a super cool character. Not exactly when she was introduced, she was almost like, okay, hold on, I'm gonna give him the opportunity to talk. Shenron. Okay, so not exactly when when um she was introduced, but yes, when she was on the world tournament fighting Goku, interestingly enough, uh, because she seemed so badass, and it it just like the, her arc became, in, especially in C, it just kind of became being this annoying um female character that didn't want anybody to fight. And it just doesn't make any sense because she used to fight as well and she used to train with Goku and I'm, I'm like, I'm pissed that they made her this way because a lot of people find her annoying as she didn't used to be that way. Her kid character was just fine. I was never a huge fan, but it provided a lot of comedy with, you know, Goku's innocence. But yeah. Okay, there we go. Oh hell yeah. Yo. Oh, and who's this little guy? Meet my son. <laughs> your, your son? Yeah. Wild, huh? Nice to meet you. Oh, oh man. Nice to meet you too. His name is Gohan. Gohan? Oh, so you named him after your grandpa, huh? Yeah. Suits him, don't you think? A reward. It's been forever. Okay, so you want me to talk to Krillin. I also kind of want to see, like, what items do I have? Because, like, they said they gave me something. Uh, apart from this, they gave me... Yeah, they gave me... I don't know, what was it? With the DLC. I guess, like, I, I completely lost the plot. Uh, um, because it says that this is all temporary, and one of the things that they said they were they were giving me was something that was permanent. But I guess that didn't happen. Or maybe these are it. I don't know. I'll I'll figure it out eventually. But yeah. And okay, let's just talk. Okay, I'm 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 actually like I wanna check out what's in here. <laughs> Oh god. Oh no, no, no. Yeah, this is you know, one of the things about OG Dragon Ball is that Master Roshi it's it, he's completely completely off the chains in that series specifically. In C he has some moments, but in OG Dragon Ball it's it's a bit messy. And as a fan of the series, as you know, you grow old and as you age, it's kinda hard to defend him. And when you don't, you know the way they wrote him, but yeah, this this was part of, of you know OG Dragon Ball, and, and you know it's not even that bad. This has been a bad moment specifically because uh, Roshi made everybody make the same uniform because that's the way that he wanted to train that day. But yeah, like this is this is big comedy Dragon Ball, and it's amazing. Yeah, I apologize, Goku. I'm gonna continue. The two find a woman named Lunch. I'm gonna try to read this, though my voice is already cracking a little bit. But yeah, um, the two find a woman named Lunch, trying to avoid the boys and bring her back to Kame House. Master Roshi is pleased with Lunch, and as soon as he has, uh, and as soon as he has her wear the turtle school uniform, there you go, something incredible happens. Lunch sneezes, causing her to go from a quiet, polite woman 
to a violent full mounted hooligan. <laughs> yeah. And she's a piece of work when she when she transforms because she even shoots up Goku and, and Krillin, you know, when they were kids. And I just think that's that's hilarious and, and really fun. I don't know if I can no, I cannot go there. And I think there's also some stuff that I saw uh outside. This is truly this this feels like a like a very complete type game. It's just weird. Oh yeah and this oh god. Goku and Bulma help a last turtle return to the sea, yeah. To show his gratitude, Turtle introduces the two to the turtle helmet and uh, Master Roshi. Master Roshi rewards Goku with the flying nimbus and Bulma with the dragon ball that he wears around his neck. Not before asking something from her, but okay. Uh, but yeah, that's yeah, that like that's the origin of, of the flying nimbus. And uh, only people with pure hearts could ride it. So that meant only Goku could do it because Roshi wasn't, obviously. And Bulma wasn't, even though she pretended she was. Yeah, no, nobody can. Okay, let's talk to Krillin and continue with the story. Goku, have you been training lately? Well, not as much as mm, mm -hmm. This is why Piccolo became... It's like, Piccolo is the, the most powerful um, being on Earth at that point. I mean, hey, you two. What are you talking about? No, uh, uh, nothing really. Hmm. I could have sworn you two were talking about how you've both been slacking off on your training. I guess there's no fooling you, is there, Master Roshi? It would seem you've both forgotten that training is a daily activity, not something you do only on special occasions. You should be moving, learning, playing, eating, and resting every day. That's the way of the turtle school. Moving, learning, playing, eating, and resting every day. Yeah, I remember that as well. It was really cool. And the, the whole training with Master Roshi at the, at the start of the series was fantastic. Okay, this is new. Come report back to me once you've finished your training. Yes, sir, Master Roshi. Yes, sir, Master Roshi. Now, time to get back to my usual enjoyment. Oh, by the way, the mouse is here. Okay, that's weird. Can I place him already? A new community board. Okay. <laughs> you can activate community skills at 8, earning Senny. Okay. This is in case I need Senny. Can I play... Okay, so... She... Uh, like, Goku and Gohan is on the, the fighting side, I guess. And this is on cooking, and this is on Senny. I'm gonna keep everything as it is right now. I don't have any other emblems anyway. Oh, okay, there's Namu, and there's also Lunch. Speak to character with a blue icon. Uh, they get you XP and items, as well as emblems. Okay. Okay, the, like, continuing the story is for Krillin, but I kind of want to... Okay, let's talk to the turtle first. Okay. Dagnabit, what the hell? Greetings. <laughs> Greetings, okay. <laughs> okay. Let's try and find Goku, uh, Roshi's porn. Yeah. A swim. <laughs> okay, where the hell? Oh, 
Oh, okay, I gotta talk to Puma. I don't know why I went ahead and did the whole round. Hello. Okay, I completely forgot what the hell he told me because I think I'm hearing a little bit of why noise or interference. So I'm, I'm going to check that out uh, in a little bit, but let's just finish this real quick. The girl I work, okay. Okay, there we go. Book for grown-ups. Okay, I got it too. That's okay. And then I can talk to Colin. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna first of all check the items because I guess this is... Yeah, this is a, a gift that I can give. Alright. Okay. So here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna pause it for a little bit. Go to the Be Right Back scene and check out my um, microphone so I'll be right back and microphone there we go okay I'll, I'm back uh i hear myself a little bit clearer and uh, yeah there was some interference i don't know what was causing it but i just fixed the cable a little bit in case something was wrong and that fixed it so yeah um i'm not really proud of this little microphone that i have but it's the one that i have to work with so yeah i apologize for that and uh, yeah i wish i just wish uh there weren't so many um you know, inconveniences, because this is not the first time that I have one with this microphone, but whatever. We can continue now, and I guess this is where we are finally introduced to Raditz. You wanna fight? Yeah, let's go! There's so many mechanics into this game already. And I like I really want to get to fighting Graditz, honestly. But okay. Try to learn. Okay, yeah, let's do it. Oh, what the hell? We gotta remember, this is a good practice anyway. Whoa, ah. Come on, man. There you go, okay. He's almost dead anyway. But I kind of want to do... Oh, I really wanted to pull that off, honestly. There you go. Rock. Okay, alright, and then I learned a new skill. Can I equip it? How can I equip it?
super attack skill tree. And this is to improve all of the things that I can learn. Okay. And then the pallet. Ah, uh, there you go. This is the, uh, can I do the A? Yeah. Meter smash and can say, okay, there you go. Okay. So I'm going to do, actually, I'm going to keep this one instead of the energy blast. And uh, yeah, okay. Yeah, this seems like a really, really in-depth experience and I was not prepared for it. I just heard really good things about it and I was like, you know, it's Dragon Ball, so I'm just going to play it. Oh. Well, Pico would change that. Yeah, please, let me continue the story, come on. Are they going to show, you know, how Raditz went for Piccolo first? Because he thought it was Goku because he was the strongest on Earth. I know I've been saying that way too much, but I just, like, I really want to see Piccolo again. I just think he was, like, the coolest in this uh, time of of the series, really. And then on, on the Cell Saga. But he fell off a lot uh, after that, which, you know, is really too bad, to be honest. He's one of my favorites, by the way, the, like, along with Tien. This is why I, you know, I go off about them. Oh god, power levels. <laughs> Is this the best this planet can muster? Oh yeah, they're gonna show it. Sorry, I'm just so confused about everything that he's trying to explain. Not sure what this is, but I better check it out. Okay, so it's it's telling me that I can also like you know go down here and, and pick this up or pick things up. It isn't Goku. Okay. But I don't know if that's worth it right now. Like, there's so much... Okay, okay, okay. okay. I've lost, uh, like, I've lost the plot already. Wait a minute, what the hell? I'm ready you are. Let's do this. There's a battle in them, okay. There's just so much, like, okay, there's enemies in the middle of going to the story. But then there's also like animals to hunt, and then there's also like items to pick up, and then some things are redder than, than others. And why is he going down? 
Not not what I meant to do at all. Okay. Where the hell could he be? Well now, this could be fun. I'm ready But what do you mean? Why do I get attacked already by a freaking robot? What the hell? I don't get it. Like what triggers me to, to encounter this? Am I not seeing it? And where do I have to go now? Like, can I... Yeah, can I move? Oh, come on, man. I saw launch there. And I kind of like... But I'm guessing I don't... I cannot enter a mission with her as Pickle. Because that would be weird. Okay. The hell is this? Hello, blue man. Catching already. Okay, but I cannot enter a a mission, just as I thought. Okay, this is a little bit wonky, I'm not gonna lie, and I don't know if I am the problem, honestly. Which, you know, it wouldn't, like, it wouldn't be surprising to me if I was, but... And then, once again, another robot that I have to face. Like, can I not? Can I just let legit just go? And I think I'm going the wrong way, by the way. <laughs> this is just a fail. Oh, God. Okay, let's go to where it tell, it's telling me to go. Like, it's right there. Okay, let's just go. Because, goddamn. No, I don't care for the waterfall. No, I don't want to have fun with the robot. I'm going to go and, and, like, actually go to the story. There you go. I don't know why it was so hard for me to check out the map and actually realize where it's telling me to go. Because there was just so much going on. It hits you with so much information. Can we fight? Yeah? Yeah, alright. Okay, but I'm level 1 and he's level 3, so that really... Okay, that's something that I wanted to learn. There are critical hits as well. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. Can I win this fight even? Because I don't think I can. I mean, being under level as fuck. And also because, like, I guess if they wanna keep it. Um, if they want to keep it real with how the series went, then, then he wouldn't win this. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, that was almost a fail. Maybe it was. I think it was suspected, but still. I have no idea at this point. Damn it. 
Okay, this is extremely tough at this point. I mean, I've done nice damage, but I need to... Oh, God. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, they're gonna beat my ass, I'm sure. And on purpose, it's not like I'm gonna lose and get a game over. I think. Okay, I finished it anyway. Yeah, I guess I'm not, yeah, I'm for sure not supposed to win this. And yeah, it's good that I leveled up. Because I was like, you know, that, that would be weird. If somehow this got me a, a game over, that would be weird. I really like the way the, the game looks, to be honest. It looks really, really good. Especially during the cutscenes. And then here we go. <laughs> Tell me, Kakarot, what is this? You were supposed to exterminate all life on this planet. What have you been doing all this time? Huh? Who are you? And who's Kakarot? Should I know who that is? You have got to be kidding me. You don't remember. Fine, then. Allow me to refresh your memory. You're not from this filthy planet. You were born on planet Vegeta. You're a member of the proud and mighty warrior race, the Saiyans. And that's not all. I'm your older brother, Raditz. You're lying. That can't be true. Yeah, because all humans grow with tails, right? Like this one's got to move. <laughs> if this guy's telling the truth, then these Saiyans are some real bad dudes. Wait. What about the move? What does that have to do with anything? Don't play dumb with me. We Saiyans release our true power whenever there's a full moon. Even chumps like you should know that. <sighs> oh, God. Yeah, they do know. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> you know, I think Krillin's right. <laughs> even if I wanted to, because planet Vegeta was blown to smithereens by a meteor. Almost all of our brethren have been turned to space dust now. Uh, including me and you, there are only four Saiyans left. Soon to be two. Just the other day, we found a planet that should fetch us a high price. The three of us were going to have a hell of a time trying to overtake it. And that's when I remembered you, Kakarot. The planet is as good as ours if you join us. Come on, Kakarot, think of the fun we'll have. Isn't your Saiyan blood boiling with excitement? I would really love to see a what-if scenario of Goku saying yes to this and joining up with Vegeta and Nappa and Raditz. It would be really cool, to be honest. Right? 
come any closer and I'll knock you sky high. Back off. <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, go ahead if you think you can. Gohan's not going anywhere. Okay, we gotta fight him right away. Okay, all right. God, stop. Okay, I was just one blow away. I was playing it safe. Let's do it. Neither of us has what it takes to face him head on. At least if we tried on our own. But together, if we were to team up, we just might be able to take him down. Yeah, you're probably right. But can I really trust you? What's your angle on all this? Don't get the wrong idea. It isn't that I care in the slightest about your little kid or the Earth. That fool is the only thing standing between me and world domination. The moment he and his cronies are out of the picture. I finally rid myself of you. Then the world will be mine for the taking. You're crazy if you think I'm about to let that happen. But for now, I guess we gotta join forces. I guess there's really no getting around that. Precisely. This version of Piku I really like. And I also like his version. I like I said in the in the Cell Saga he's really freaking cool cool, to be honest. But yeah. I just really enjoy this type of interactions with them with him and Goku. Buy the drink, okay. No, cannot be used. Register in the pallet. It recovers HP, okay, alright. And I don't know why he uses the flying Nimbus still, because I believe that he can fly it already, but, you know.
Dream Team, all right. Here we go, all right. I hopefully they will let me play straight up the fight that I need to do. Mm-hmm. I'm reading this, but... Offense and support, offense and support will, pre it will take actions to protect you during battle. And uh, restoring HP. Okay. You can now travel to other areas and then you can do... Okay, for now... Yeah. Recall anything about the seance that Raditz clown was going on about? No, none of it rings a bell. Crazy. Hey, hold on. I had an older brother either. How the hell do I, yeah. Some useful information out of you for our fight. Where is Luca Village? Where the hell is Luca Village? Uh, yeah, I'm completely, again, lost. I guess, like, maybe if I, I, because I have, I don't know if, if you guys see my radar, but I just don't see anything. Where the hell is it? Am I tripping? Like... Is this not something that's happened? I guess maybe that's it. Because I do see something there. But am I like, am I wrong? Like, is there something like, I don't know why the, the Dragon Raider is not showing me where the hell I have to go. Like, is this it? No, this is, no, this is not it. What the hell, dude? Um, I really want to know where the hell I'm I'm going to. Uh, can I go to world map? Oh, okay. Now, okay. I should have known. I was like, yeah, that this is weird. I don't know why it's showing me an area, but it's not showing me really. And I guess it's not showing me like the whole world map because it will be incredible to to load everything. And being being able to fight to flight um to everything. But yeah, okay, this makes more sense. Hey, there's a steel bridge. His tail probably is weak point. If we can squeeze his tail, he should be Where is Pickle? What happened whenever mine got grabbed? How are we supposed to grab his tail? I have no idea, but yeah. Can I fight that dinosaur? I'm sorry. Oh, come on. There you go, okay. Can I already like check out if I can fight that dinosaur? Yeah. Can I fight it? I really want to fight it, I don't know why. Or can I like punch it or something? No? Okay. Oh wait, where? Okay, I'm like, oh wait a second. Eating food and dishes can permanently increase your stats, provide a limited support times. It's okay. Okay.
this is like the first big, big fight of the series in C. And at the time, I believed that Gohan couldn't be that strong because he was presented like such a coward, you know. And I think that's also kind of bullshit that they made him, like they made Piccolo look like he's very close to Goku, even though like it's not the case, as you will see in the battle. Alright, let's go. Okay, like that's fucking move. Oh, you can still work. Remember that. Can you do something else like that? Okay, there you go. Yeah, that is very helpful. I also have to move. Okay, he's gonna hit me, yeah. I'm like, yeah, he's gonna hit me with something very, very powerful. There you go. Okay, that makes sense. That's a little combo. You gotta remember to ward. Move, move, move. Guard. Okay. There's so much in this fight left. And Pico is not doing anything, or not much at least. Okay, yeah, that's really tight. I do also remember that Goku um, removes his weighted clothing before the fight. Okay, finish already. But yeah, he removes it. I don't know if it's before the fight or during it, but yeah, it doesn't make sense. To me, in my mind, that he's fighting this way. It's just iconic. I, rem I think this fight is really underrated in this series, to be honest. It's weird to see him with his blue clothes right now. I don't know if I'm, I'm probably fucking up. Maybe that's not the case. But I think he did take them off. Right, here we go. Yeah. Because we gotta fight him by ourselves. And I'm, I'm, you know, 
completely messed up already. Gord, yeah. Gord again. Oh God, move. Oh, okay. I was not ready for that. I'm sorry, but I, I completely had no idea that he was going to do that. Okay, he's tough, to be honest. He's really tough. Yeah, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is going to be a recurring thing. To be getting completely handed my ass to myself. Nobody boss. What the hell? Why is this in slow motion? Just... Ah, okay. I was trying to guard and I was hitting the wrong button. Oh, God. I know I'm getting nervous, though. Like, come on. There's no way you lose to Raditz, right? Okay, move. You gotta move. Okay, but this is different. This is different. Yeah, move. Oh, God. What the hell? Okay, 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 okay. We might actually die. Okay, thank God for Bulma's thing that she gave us. Because God. Okay, that was good. And then move. But, oh, okay, okay, he's gonna hit us. He's gonna hit us. Wait for it, and then go, 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 go. Okay. And then just move, 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 move. I don't know how this is working, but yeah. Okay. It kind of worked. Like, at least enough. And then... Very important for you to hit. Okay, hit him and then... Guard. And then hit him. Okay, okay, okay. You're kind of learning. Yeah, he was really tough in the series as well. And I think this is... It's cool that they gave him... Um, you know, a really hard boss battle to start. Though, you know, I wish he wasn't kicking my ass. But it wouldn't... Whatever. I Okay, we're almost done. We're almost done. You got it. Okay, that was good. Ah. Oh, it was a critical hit and I'm like, okay, that makes sense. That's good. I also have like one of those gorgeous thing. I don't know what the hell. There you go. Use it, and then move. Oh, I got caught in a combo. Okay, this is good. This is a... Okay. Oh, come on, man. I have the freaking gotch. Just use the Kamehameha and wait for the best. Hope for the best. And then hit him with this. Hit. Okay, I'm losing it. I'm losing it if it's... Okay, I'm completely losing my cool right now. Yeah, and then he... Oh, come on, man! That's some bullshit. Okay, okay, okay. 
Go, 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 go. Yes! Okay, alright, I thought I was dead. That was really tense. God, that, that freaking super is like undodgeable at first. Okay, there you go. I was so sure I was dead. Okay, there he goes. And then the tail and Goku being dumb. Ah, oh, god damn it. Me, brother. I'm begging you, Kakarot. Don't do this to your only family. That's one of the frustrating moments of Goku, really. I can't believe you fell for it. You might actually be the dumbest guy I've ever met. Let me get ready to show you mercy just because you're my little brother. Just wait until a couple of arcs later. You'll see. Here he comes. <laughs> that was one of my favorite things, for sure, to watch. Gohan was the first master of the Kaioken. Oh, hell yeah. That was groundbreaking at it at the time. Completely, absolutely, because nobody was expecting Goku to die within the first fight. You know, because yeah, at, at the, if you didn't know about Dragon Ball before, you know, this... You don't know much about Goku or anything, but uh, if you knew about OG Dragon Ball and uh, you were watching C... You were like, what the hell is this, you know? <laughs> and it was like groundbreaking for me. My dad knew what was happening, of course, when we watched together, you know, it was obvious. Uh, but he saw my reaction and, and it was always funny to him. But yeah, this is just pure nostalgia. I love this. I love this game so much right now with all the references and, and the pictures and, and, you know. Though it's a little convoluted, in my opinion, but you know. Oh, and yeah. This planet is home to the Dragon Balls. They grant wishes. Absolutely any wish imaginable. Even bringing someone back from the dead. Oh, damn it. Well, my comrades will be happy to hear that. <laughs> Everything you just 
was transmitted to them on the other side of the universe. Once they've learned that I've died, they will come here. Piccolo, the king of exposition, right there and then. And then Raditz fucks up by throwing them. <laughs> Damn it. One year before even stronger warriors arrive. You two have no hope of beating them. Destroy what little. Okay, click. There you go. Just die, bro. Okay. Hey, that's pretty much it. Come on, Goku. Hang in there. Yeah, okay. Okay. <laughs> Hang in there, you only have a hole to your fucking stomach. You know, that's pretty normal. Don't you worry, we're gonna bring you back really <laughs> Goku. What the he's gone. Interesting. I bet Kami has something to do with this. Yeah. Well, I guess we can put our minds at ease if Kami's involved. You guys need to get the Dragon Balls. Kami doesn't possess the power needed to bring someone back to life. Also, Goku's kid will be coming with me for the time being. Hey, what? Uh, you're kidding, right? What are you gonna do with him? With a little training and the right teacher, that kid could be capable of serious power. We're going to need all the power we can get before those two Saiyans show up in a year's time. Me training this little runt is our best shot to stand up. Once Goku's revived, tell him he'll get his son back and in better shape than he left him. All right. And then we got a lot of stuff, and then you know there's Vegeta. of attaining immortality with the Dragon Balls, the two Saiyans made their way to Earth. And that is why I brought him here as he is. To be trained, but therefore, if it is agreeable to you, King Yama. Hmm, I see. So you intend to take this heaven-bound soul and subject him to the grueling 625,000 miles. Indeed. Very well. If you wish to see King, however, I should warn you that no one has ever, ever made it successfully. Other than myself, of course, in over 100 million years. Must be one heck of a journey. I better get started. By the way, did a guy named Raditz come through here? Yes. We've got him marked down for hell, of course. Did he put up much of a fight? <laughs> he sure did. He definitely didn't go quietly. 
but I sorted him out. Whoa! You must be one heck of a strong guy! So, you were sent along with him, huh? I am the great King Yemma. I occupy a position. Do you know what that means? That means you're crazy strong, right? You don't seem to understand what I'm saying. But it's not just my strength that serves me in this position. You need... And a man of what work? Now then, to help you better understand my work... Uh, well, uh... Well then. If that's going to be your attitude, then I guess you... Oh, god damn it, okay. Why didn't you say that anyway? Let's begin. Okay, okay, come on. Raditz was on to hell. That's right. In fact, he's right. Uh, King Yama, of course. Uh, everyone. That's right. No matter where they're from, all who die come like your brother. Next question. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not bad. That's correct. Those pesky dragons. Pesky. I hate those things. It's like my job doesn't even matter. Who created those blasted balls anyway? To shed some light on that, Kami? Oh, uh, <laughs> Okay, he's hella. Which question is this? Oh my god, I have no idea. Five? Ah! Sorry. Huh? What? This is the fifth question. Really? Uh, hmm, of course it was. I and you. All right. Yeah, maybe. Come on, Kami. I agree, actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on. Up, kid. You've slept long enough. Uh, who, who are you? Listen up. It's time for a reality check. Your daddy is dead, okay? He sacrificed himself to kill the man who kidnapped you, in case you forgot. Friends are vigilant and able to find the Dragon Balls. They can bring him back. However, we've got other things to deal with. Though we were able to defeat Raditz, it sounds like we've got two of his buddies to worry about a year from now. If that's really the case, your father and I probably aren't going to be enough to take these guys down. We need power. Your power. You're going to have to learn to fight and defend the Earth. Gohan's Crash Course in Survival. B but I... Okay, I'm back. I apologize. I was trying to fix my microphone again. Because I decided to fuck up again. But yeah, I, le I left you guys with the... Um, you know, cutscene. And also, you know, the beautiful soundtrack that Gohan has. survive for that long I'll teach you how to fight see ya oh, wait it's scary out here don't leave me ah! 
Okay, I'm guessing we play as Gohan now. Yeah. Okay, so there you go. Okay, something that I want to check out is this. Like, what if I go ahead and check this out? Like, what the hell is this? New transformation and training and new items that are uh, XP and then... New transformation and training and horror bottles added and three new substars. Well, this seems like something that I should be checking out later. I know this is a full story, but I don't know what these are, to be honest. Uh, but I'll check them out later, yeah. Because, I don't know. I just, I don't think I can, I don't think I can, I, I, I guess I can indeed like access them, but it just feels, it will feel weird, you know, I don't know. It's not, it's not explaining anything. It just says new transformation, new training, and new items are what uh, XP. And then this is uh, Android Assault Battles, and then six new sub stories, and this is two new, I don't know. I was just trying to check it out to see if there's like because I saw that it was in the menu, but I don't know how to use it to be honest. Hmm. I would love to know, but uh, I'll 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 check that out later. Okay. This is the start of the, you know, awesome friendship that Pico and Gohan end up having. And also, I really like his outfit when Gohan, when Pico trains him. And uh, yeah, the dinosaur with the tail, yeah. <laughs> Oh no, and now he has to get off. Get down there. Without his power because he can't control it. Okay, well, yeah, 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 I do, I'll, I'll check it out later. With the whole DLC, I'm gonna just uh, open the Steam store and read what the hell I got into, but I, because I did want to play the Trunk story, but I don't know what else is in there. But yeah, I, I read about a special food item and whatever, and I was like, okay, that's cool. And I didn't realize that like there's a whole cooking system and everything so uh, yeah okay um i'm sorry if i didn't ramble as much as i usually do like this was a really focused like game focused stream which is which has been rare to me uh, because i usually like speak out about a lot of different stuff and what's happening in in life and, and you know i provide commentary on anything really and i ramble on uh but this was uh really fun anyway i enjoy dragon ball c a lot it's, it's one of my favorite series of all time i will say it's even like my favorite series of all time so it's really fun to, to revisit this type of memories and this type of stories um but yeah uh, i i want to say uh, thank you for watching and thank you for giving this a shot hopefully you guys will like it i think maybe tomorrow i will do hades instead or maybe even uh, switch it out for something like gunjur or something like that hopefully um it works out fine but um yeah uh thank you so much for watching and and hopefully you will buy with this and you'll enjoy it and if you didn't then that's fine and, and just 
uh, give me like comment and suggestions of what would you like to see instead. Um, but I just really wanted to give this a chance. It's a really, you know, it's kind of like an RPG from what I see it because it has a whole skill tree, a skill tree and everything. So I'm guessing that that it will become, you know, a whole story and a whole thing to to invest time into and i mean i'm more used into big mechanic um driven games and and now that i think about it maybe fighter c will be a better choice for the things that i'm looking for but because this is more story driven um but it, i still had a lot of fun regardless and hopefully you know being quiet during cutscenes i know that some people like to hear the the streamers say stuff uh, during cutscenes and they don't mind because everybody knows the Dragon Ball Z story. Some people don't like it because they want to see like you know the cutscenes and everything. So I'm learning my ways through through all of this. But um, yeah, thank you, thank you so much for watching. At last, this is my outro, and goodbye. I'll see you on the next one, hopefully. Bye bye.